Enchanté. It's pretty much the day I've been waiting for. This is farm cleanup day. I have brand new light like tools that I'm going to play with. I'm gonna edge, I'm gonna mow, I'm gonna make a few fences, and we're gonna clean up all the chaos that the snow has revealed. I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone. I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations, oh. Cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting. But then you came along and proved me all wrong I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me wanna try forever And I feel so free Oh, my sweet baby So stuck, I kept on playing my part, wanted to give it cause nothing was changing. But with you it's so clear, and now that you're here, I see colors and never spectrum. Guess I finally learned my Mom, lesson. I turned five. Cause you glue all the pieces back together. Yeah, yeah, you, um. you take all my wrongs and make them better. <laughs> yeah, you, you're making me want to try forever. I I am my mom. And I think to myself, and I'm thinking out loud, we won't need nothing else for the rest of our time. And I know it so well, I will always be by your side. the pieces back together Mom, you got me Yeah, you, Mom, you, you take them off and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me want to try forever I feel so free Oh, my sweet baby my wrongs and make them better yeah you you're making me want to try forever i feel so free i'm a sweet baby young sir he is so cute there's so much to do on a farm in the spring. No matter how small your small holding is, there is still plenty of work to be done. We are top dressing a few of our more anemic beds in some beautiful topsoil that is full of compost that we got from a local farmer. Everything is shaping up. There's much more to be done, but I'm starting to feel like maybe over the next week, everything could start to come together. That is if we can keep the rain at bay. They say we're supposed to get a lot of rain. This is what typically happens when I get started outside. I say that I'm going to do cleanup and it's going to be this big week of project cleanup around the farm and I just end up gardening. I can't help myself.
have to tell you, I do appreciate the rain. I am grateful for it. But it's been day after day after day. I've got my new toys I wanna to play with. I wanna get this garden planted and spruced up. I think I might just go out and slog about in the wet grass because I don't think I can stay inside much longer. We've had piles of compost brought in. We've had piles of topsoil brought in. Got a few things planted and I know it's all in good time. And I feel like after living further south, I'm still in this mode of adjustment living this far north. And while much of the country is experiencing spring, you know, in all its force, I'm still just enjoying the muscari and the tulips are just beginning to appear and there's there are barely buds on the trees so I know I need to be patient but I am chomping at the bit so I think I'm gonna go take my camera out to the garden and just um, see if I can just capture some beauty to just settle settle my heart down a little bit and I don't know maybe I'll mow a little bit because there's more storms coming tomorrow and the grass is getting pretty long and I want it to look tidy before it gets out of control. It is beautiful. It is, it is getting very green, but I am tired of being indoors. Truth be told, my new Lifely tools have been so helpful. Because they're lightweight and they're not loud, so they don't bother my tennis elbow and my ear at all. I was really adverse to having grass in my garden when we first started this garden three years ago. Now I'm trying to embrace this country garden feel, and I think that I am going to try to get very good at growing grass. Surrendering to the grass path has been a challenge for me. Originally, I wanted to continue the pea gravel down into this expanse for sort of that Giverny garden in the front of the house feel. But the longer we've lived here, and this is now the beginning of the fourth year of this garden, the more I'm embracing this rural, chic country garden look. And I think this is my year where I'm going to get very good at grass. You'll see there, see that purple? Most of the lawn is wild thyme. And anything that's not is wild oregano, which is very invasive and hard to keep on top of. And weeds and crabgrass. And there are dips and dives from where we dug out trees or removed large juniper bushes. And I think this is the year where I would like to make the lawn, the grass pathways look beautiful. I'll leave the wild thyme because it is so gorgeous when it blooms. But other than that, I think I would like to take my hand at creating a very manicured, clean look in between all the beds and really showcase that green. The daffodils have just begun. The muscari is in full bloom. And even though we are recovering from a lot of rain, the overcast sky lets your eye absorb everything that you're seeing. The vibrant lichen, the vibrant pops of purple, even the lettuces that are just beginning to show off. I expect that it will be another wonderful season of gardening, the fourth year of what was once a forest. This week has not gone at all the way we had planned, and I am feeling like I'm just about ready to wave the white flag of surrender. And I know so many gardeners have felt the same way at some point or another, but seriously. In fact, I think as I'm looking at the camera, I see little snow particles coming down. So I'm going to head inside. I'm going to put on my pajamas 
and make a fire. Maybe I'll spend a little time in the greenhouse potting on some tomatoes and some peppers and know that tomorrow is another day. If you need to binge on a little gardening content while you're contemplating waving that white flag of surrender, check out this series right here. Be sure that you are a member of my Old World Design Society, and I will see you again very soon. Abiento.